all power wheelchair driver controls, regardless of the manufacturer, fall into one of two categories. Proportional, also called analog, or non-proportional, also called digital. A proportional driver control operates with similarities to the gas pedal of a car. The farther you push or move something, the faster the wheelchair will go. A traditional joystick on a power wheelchair is a great example of a proportional control. Proportional hand controls are generally the first choice when selecting any driver control. They give the user the most control over varied terrain and environments, allow slow driving when required in small spaces, react for faster driving when needed, and provide precise directional control for accessibility and maneuverability. A digital driver control is simply a switch, similar to a car horn. It's either on or it's off. Driving in any direction is either on or off when that switch is activated. Typically, there are four switches in the system for the four directional quadrants, forward, left, right, and reverse. There are ways, though, to drive in four directions when you have less than four switches. See the video RIM, or three-quadrant driving, to learn more on this topic. Driving directions with the digital control are very discreet, very defined, either forward or left or right. Two switches, such as forward and right, can be pressed at the same time to drive off in a rear direction. This is very helpful when using driver controls such as an ASL switch head array, closing the forward and right switches to drive off in a rear direction. Switch controls are generally selected after ruling out the user's ability to safely operate any type of proportional control. Users that benefit from switch controls include those with limited control or limited movement, as well as those with excessive muscle tone or uncontrolled reflexive movements. The types of switches that can be incorporated into a digital driver control include both mechanical switches that require contact with the switch for activation, such as this wafer board, or electrical switches, such as this proximity switch in the wings of the head array, or fiber optic switches in this tray that require only getting close or covering the switch to activate it. There are two primary ways to drive at different speeds when using a switch driver control. One is by using latched driving, another video in this series. The other is by simply switching to a different drive profile that's programmed for a different speed. Lastly, non-expandable control systems, such as those using an SPJ joystick, cannot accept digital or switch driver controls. Only expandable electronic programs can accept switch controls. Proportional or non-proportional, analog or digital, choices to allow users independent mobility.